What's in the box? In the box. What's in the box from Flora and Fauna? What's in the box? In the box. What's in the box from Flora and Fauna? I am so excited. This is my first order with Flora and Fauna. I got some sample products to try. Um, because I want to, I don't have much makeup, but I'm trying to, I figure if I'm going to get back into makeup, I kind of want to do it in a vegan, cruelty-free way. I am not vegan, but I think that no animals should be harmed in what I'm putting on my face and my body. And I also think that, which I know is ironic, I just, um, I'm slightly anemic and some other things, so I actually was vegetarian or semi-veg for a very long time but anyway that's a whole other story that's not the purpose of this video so what I'm going to do is split this into two videos because there is a box within a box um, because I ordered they had a $15 sample box that is a value at $40 and I've seen Miri Bluebeard and a couple of other people unbox when they get Flora and Fauna and they're just are amazing value amazing quality and I bought some other stuff now the reason I could afford to do this is they have something called Afterpay, which is new to me, and a few sites I've seen do do it, where you can split your payments into, um, it's like four payments. So instead of paying um, the, it was $47, I think, once I had a, used a discount code, um, I think I have to pay like $11 a fortnight, which I can fit comfortably into my budget without it being an issue, even at this time of year. And I haven't splurged or anything like this for so long. I haven't done an unboxing on my channel that hasn't been a gift in so long. So I wanted to do this and I'm so excited. So I have had a sneak peek. Well, I opened the box. But when you open the box, this is what you're going to see. ta -da! Nothing! Yep. What's in the box? In the box. So we're gonna open it. I'll just hold it here for a minute. We're gonna. I love this brown paper. It's such lovely quality. This I will be using in crafting. It's so beautiful. So this is what you get. Now this is the sample box. So I'm going to do that in a separate video because I think it deserves its own video in case anyone wants to get one if they still have any. Now this is the stuff that I ordered for me and you get a little note from the owner of the store, Jules, and it says, Hi Amanda, thanks for your order and we hope you um, love your goodies, love Jules, and it just has a thing and it has share to win um, we want to hear from you simply share a picture on Facebook or Instagram and tag us you'll go into the monthly draw to win a hundred dollar gift certificate I'm so doing that I'm so down for that so now I'm going to open this up and the first thing I am pulling out these are the things I ordered um, is pure vanilla healthy fragrance now I don't use a lot of fragrance but I love the scent of vanilla and this was like five dollars so I thought for like a like you pay that for a little designer perfume and this one is pure so a pure Madagascar vanilla sheer freesia and creamy tonka bean the healthy frank fragrance in the, 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 I suddenly I just sounded really weird then but the healthy fragrance um infuses extraordinary blends of pure essential oils with nurturing botanicals that pamper the body and the soul no petrochemicals um, phthalates, propylene, glycol, mineral oils, silicon synthetic dyes, sulfates or parabens. 100% recyclable and not tested on animals. And that's the little box. The little box is really pretty. Like I would probably cover up the stuff and use that as a little gift box and, you know, I'd probably have to just remove that little bit in the centre. But that's a really nice little box. Let's smell it, shall we? Let's just... Oh, that is beautiful. That is lovely. It smells like an expensive perfume. Like it, you wouldn't know that there was none of the bad stuff in it. That is absolutely lovely. I love that. And for $5, like a little one of these will last me quite a while. So I could just splurge on a small set, trial size. And I like trial size things because you don't know how something's going to smell on your skin. Oh. It fades to this really pretty floral vanilla. That's the only way I can describe it. Really, really beautiful product. Um, 
Okay, so what else is in here? Let's go for the little one. I I bought this to try. I know I can make my own deodorant and I, I have considered doing that. Um, but I just thought I'd give this a try. This was like $7, I think, and it is... Oh, I need to move my light just a little. Woohoo deodorant paste. So let's... What's in this one? Just says travel size sample. Oh, it's nice and creamy. There's a scent in here that I can't quite pick up on. Um, doesn't leave your skin oily. Really nice, actually. I'm going to enjoy trying that, to be honest. And that, because it's, uh, even though it's only small, it's a paste, it probably will last a good while, like a reasonable, reasonable while. Um, okay. So I'm going to pull the last, well, knock things out, is that there's lots of paper... I don't mind the packaging because I will reuse it. Anyone who gets orders through my Etsy store often gets recycled. Um, like it, like the outer packaging, the stuff that stops it getting damaged is always recycled. Um, this box is a lovely box. Like it's nice and snug. That I think I'm going to save that to send a parcel or something in. Okay, so the next things we have are all, these are all sample sizes. So they weren't super expensive. They weren't super cheap. This was, I think, ten dollars the this is a anika trial pack um i light <coughs> excuse me i don't even know why that suddenly <coughs> i went for light to very fair i probably reading up on freckles and things maybe should have gone one higher but let's have a look at what's in this and I just thought it was a nice way to try this is certified organic certified vegan I don't wear makeup all the time so for someone like me who doesn't wear a ton of makeup but and may not have the money to invest in the bigger products I thought this is a good way to try stuff find what works for me and then maybe I can do an afterpay order and just do one or two products at a time. So the so I love how it's I love it's got the paper shred. I've been wanting paper shred for ages. Um, okay, so this is oh look at how beautiful that just just the packaging. Look how beautiful that is. Um, okay, so it's got the little thing on it. So we've got I'm not going to pull everything apart. Actually, yeah, I'll swatch. Let me. Uh, I love that it comes sealed. Okay. <laughs> that little pull-up tab is stuck in. So, okay, let's see. Oh. So you've got this little, like the little shake a bit. So let's shake some out. Get some on my finger. And I'm just going to swatch. I don't know if you can see it. It's fairly light. See the powdery bit on my hand? right there <laughs> I can't I can't even oh right <laughs> okay let's move that light out of the way for a minute and see if you can see it better no it's very blends into my skin it's kind of what you want <laughs> so we've got that one and that is loose mineral foundation strength number n3 then we have uh, not like getting these little tab pulls out they're a bit too tiny um ah there we go pulled it up with scissors let's see if i can get this is like i've got big fat fingers um so that's a little harder for me to get okay so let's just tap a little bit of this out onto my hand and i don't know like you're not really going to see the powderiness as much because it blends in a lot it's up here but like, yeah, it really does blend in lovely. Um, so this is shade P1. So I think I probably might, if I wanted it to show up on camera, need to go up a shade, but I need to try these first. Then I have 83% um, organic. Hmm. So 
So there's a primer, which is good because I don't have any primer. So let's see what this is. Okay, so it's just a white um, cream. So just, oh, a little of that goes a very long way. Like I just, that little bit I pulled out, oops, <laughs> just went all the way along there. So a little bit of that goes a long way. That'll be nice. So if I like this, I may buy this because it'll go a very, very long way. And then we have a foundation. So let's use a little bit of this. I don't know how my swatching is going. My swatching is not going very good at the moment. Um, I'm not going to rub that in too much so you can actually see the foundation. Um, it's sort of like that porcel porcelain-y beige colour, I guess. Um, and then it's, I rubbed it in and you can't see. See, that's the thing. You can't see the shade. Um, okay, so that's, that, that's a really nice little box of goodies for $10. Um, like, I know I can get cheap makeup. I don't have loads of money for makeup, but I would, if I'm going to do, if I am going to get into doing my makeup more, I want to get into doing it right. Um, I may not be able to afford the fancy expensive lipsticks and eyeshadows and things, but at least start out the, the base right. Um, and there are a lot of companies that are cruelty free and um, vegan and stuff like that anyway. Okay, so this is... Um, Zooey Organic Primers, and they are the colour correcting ones. So I got mint, mauve, and apricot, and you just get a little sample pot. Um, so there's just a little bit in each one. Um, looking at it, it probably goes a reasonable way. So there might be two or three applications of each, but it'll give me a chance to figure out which one is right for me. This was like five or six dollars. Um, and then there's the apricot. I won't swatch those. Um, but yeah, so for, for $6, so like $2 a little pot, it gives me a chance to try something. And a lot of, you know, even with the bigger companies or cheap makeup, you're stuck with something that you're not going to use. And I'm not a fan of that. I'll, I'll be honest. I'm not a fan of having useless things in my stash. Okay, I don't know what these are. But, oh, okay, yes, I do. Um, these are Hydrating Cleanser. And this is... Mukti, Mukti, okay, and I love these little pots that they've used because as a crafter, I can definitely reuse those. Marigold Hydrating Cream, this was a super, like, and hydrating moisturiser, so, um, there's that, although there's not much in that one, that looks like it might have lost, like, um, lost a little volume over time, and then there's... That's the Marigold Hydrating Cream, and it looks slightly yellow, which is, like, really nice. And then the Hydrating Cleanser. So I just thought they were nice to try. Like, I just I wanted to try a few things, see how I went. I love these little calico bags that they've stamped flora and fauna on. I can definitely reuse those. Um, I can put, like, a little embellishment or something there just to hide the flora and fauna and recycle which I really love so that is what I purchased um so this was part of what I purchased um so adds up to minus the $15 that this was um say $30 $33 I think for all of this which is a lot when you think about it, I, I get that. But some of this stuff will go, oh, I'm trying, I should be holding it up. Some of this stuff will go really far and some of it will be really, really useful. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. I will let you know. I may even try the products out on camera if I can find a little mirror because I'm curious to see how they stack up um, against stuff that I've already been using. And I will come back and do a, actually this will probably go up first, um, do the Flora and Fauna sample box. Yay! Okay, comment below and let me know what you think. Do you use makeup? Um, I'm not good with makeup. I'm going to be honest with that. I'm fair, very basic. Um, you know, basics are really, real big insult amongst girls these days. And I'm like, my whole aesthetic is, a, is basic. Like, that's just who I am. I'm a basic girl. Um, even as a crafter, like, I do things that are fancier, but they look very basic. So that's just me. Um, anyway, 
remember like comment subscribe as always you are incredible you are amazing and you matter have a wonderful day i will leave a link to flora and fauna below because they are an amazing australian company and they do sell a lot of every there's a lot for all different budget ranges on their site which i thought was really really cool okay bye